here. What's this fifty dollars to a RTLM? Reverend Travis Lemon Ministries. I made a donation. The goofy guy with the hair? He's not goofy. And he preaches the gospel in a way that speaks to me. Yeah, well, let me speak to you. We can't be throwing away 50 bucks. We are not throwing it away. We are going to get that money back plus some. Oh, honey, now come on. You can't possibly believe that BS. Maybe. Reverend Travis says that Jesus wants us to prosper. Is that why he huffed and puffed and blew my house down? I'm canceling this check. Don't you dare. Mary, this is groceries for a week. We will get it back. We just need to have faith. Will you talk some sense into your daughter? If I could talk sense into her, she would never have married you. We, she had to marry me because I got her pregnant. Ha! Uh. He ain't wrong about the money. Thank you! Howdy, neighbor. Pastor Jeff, how nice to see you. Am I interrupting anything? No, no. Come on in. So, what brings you by? Well, I've been thinking, uh, we really miss you over at the church, and maybe you might consider coming back. Well, that's awful kind of you, but I've joined a new church. The Methodists got you, didn't they? Oh, no. Reverend Travis Lemon. Oh, not the fellow with the hair. Mary, he's a snake oil salesman, taking people's money and promising them all kinds of riches. Well... Then have you explain this check I got from the IRS? $800. I sent Reverend Travis 50, and that came the very next day. Oh, come on. It had to be in the mail before you sent your money in. Did it? Of course. I'm as patriotic as the next guy, but our postal service flat out sucks. Excuse my French. Well, we disagree. Reverend Travis says that the Lord wants me to be prosperous, and I believe him. This is nothing but a coincidence. You overpaid your taxes, you got a refund, Jesus has nothing to do with it. You sound like Sheldon. I believe I know my way out. Lord, I know everyone thinks I'm being foolish giving money to Reverend Travis, but why wouldn't you want us to be prosperous? You love us. It makes sense. And I got that IRS check, which feels like a sign. And I think I know a sign when I see one. Ah! Oh! 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 What's going on? A bird did its business in my eye. Better in your mouth, right? You think you're funny? Yeah. We Someone's having a party and we weren't invited. Well, honey, not too much you can do about a broken toe. Unless you think Reverend Travis can fix it. Maybe I'll stick it up your butt. Mary Cooper, language. I'm going to bed. I'm in. My bottom is scorched. Don't look at it. And as we're passing the collection plate, let's give a warm welcome to the Coopers, who are back in the fold. Our donation room is looking a little empty after the tornado, so please bring in your canned goods, your used clothing. <gasps> is that beer? <gasps> anyway, welcome back, Coopers. Please turn to page 37 in your hymnals. And little dreamer that's your heart's so high. Take a 